Hey everyone, this is going to be my Blu-ray haul from the past, uh, say about a week and a half, probably not even that. I've got a couple titles here, a couple I haven't seen, some I'm really excited to check out. So first one I have here is Kubo and the Two Strings. I've done an unboxing video of this just recently on my channel. Uh, if you haven't seen it, the annotation will be around here somewhere. Uh, this was my favourite movie of 2016. Uh, the stop motion in this, honestly, guys, is just absolutely gorgeous. Um, yeah, it's so beautiful and well crafted. Recommend checking it out if you haven't seen it. Uh, this one's from HMV, it's got a cool little comic book inside it. Um, so, yeah, Kubo, very happy to have this one. Next up is a movie I'd never seen before, and that is The Descendants. I picked this up after hearing relatively good things about it. Uh, some kind of like depressing yet funny coming of age drama type story. Um, I'm not like the biggest George Clooney fan. Um, I find him to be like quite a mediocre type of actor. Um, but I actually really enjoyed this film. I was quite surprised with it. I didn't think I was going to sit through it all. Um, but yeah, pleasantly surprised by this one. I enjoyed this one, so I was happy to pick this one up. Next up is Cabin in the Woods. Now this one always gets very highly spoken of. Um, I remember watching it for the first time when it came out and not liking it very much. But I think it's honestly because I just wasn't really paying attention and all I remember is the ending. So I picked it up, looking forward to going back into this one, giving it another go. And hopefully, you know, I like it the second time round. And I hope I do because um, it honestly seems like something I would enjoy. So I'm not sure as to why I didn't, but... Yeah, happy to give that one another watch. Next up is Prom Night. This is an upgrade from my DVD. I watched this when I was 13 years old. So it's kind of one of those ones that I know it's not that great because I watched it when I was young. But it's kind of just still just a good bit of cheese I can have one in the background. Um, and to be honest, you know, I don't like mind it too much. It's, um, you know, a good Britney Snow performance. You can really tell, you know, how talented she is in this one because, you know, she outshines the other actors by quite a margin. Um, but, yeah, happy to pick this one up. It was only, like, a couple of pounds brand new on eBay, so, you know, it's no loss, really. Uh, next one is a film I haven't seen yet, and that is Zombie Holocaust. I'm very, very excited to check this one out. I'm going to actually watch it after I've done with this video. Um, I'm trying to like build up my slasher, zombie, gore, horror collection. And this is from the Italian collection. It's, let me try and fix it. It's number five of the collection. Um, you get like a ton of bonus features on these ones, which I'm very excited to check out. Let's see if I can focus on that and show you all. There you go. So you got brand new HD. The one I'm most looking forward to is the Eaten Alive, the new feature length documentary about the Italian cannibal film phenomenon. There's a Q&A, you know, there's uh, alternative art on the other side of the sleeve. You know, it all looks very cool, and you can tell by those pictures there just how awesome that looks. Um, so yeah, I'm honestly, I'm so excited to check this one out as soon as I'm done with this video. So that is Zombie Holocaust. Yeah, last up, but certainly not least, it's another one from the Italian collection, and that is A Blade in the Dark. Um... I did want to watch this one tonight, but my boyfriend really wants to see this one. So I've decided to wait for him, and then we'll watch this one together. Um, but after watching the trailer and everything, I've been wanting to see this one for quite a while. So I'm so happy that I finally, you know, went and picked it up. Like I said, I'm trying to build up this kind of collection. Um, and this one is number six, yeah? And again, like, super awesome, like, bonus features on here. Um, let's have a look. Yeah, so it's available to watch in either English language or Italian. Uh, you've got a collectible poster art card inside, an interview with cinematographer, you know, Q&A, Italian open credits, closing credits, and again, another reversible sleeve. And just look at those gory pictures. I'm very excited to check this one out. Um, let's see if we can open it up and I'll have a look at the art card inside because I haven't actually opened it yet. I think I'm going to pick up some more of these um, Italian collection films because the bonus feature content on them is, you know, it's pretty awesome. So let's have a look. So 
a disc. Uh, I'm just gonna put it away for a second. The inside artwork, it's kind of the same, it's just uh, written in Italian. Um, yeah, collectible poster art card. Um, there isn't one inside here, so if any of you have this, let me know if I'm missing something because I'll take it back to the shop and return it and get a new one. Um, so, yeah, please let me know if you have because um, uh, I was expecting like a little something inside, but I don't know, maybe it's just the actual sleeve but I don't know maybe there's something missing but yeah I'm still I'm very excited to check this one out though so let me know if you have any of these films let me know what you think of them and uh, comment subscribe like and I'll see you in the next video take care guys bye